There's a lot going on in our region this weekend, but for the historic city of Gladewater, it's rodeo season. And it's a major annual event that helps bring tourism to the city from out of town spectators to professional bull riders. Our Jose Alonso reports from the fairgrounds about what it means to have an event like this there. I'm here at the Gladewater Rodeo Fairgrounds, where as you can see, many East Texans are here and ready to have a good time. But of course, it's not all about fun, as the rodeo also contributes to the city's local tourism. Earlier today, I was able to catch up with some event coordinators, along with a vendor who came all the way from out of state. Tourism is very important to Gladewater. It brings visitors here to our rodeo. It brings shoppers downtown to our stores. Lois Reed with the city's Chamber of Commerce says as soon as this year's event ends, they automatically start planning for the next one. What's also special about this event is their ties to the professional rodeo Cowboys Association. We have prime cowboys and cowgirls, and so if they place here, they earn points which will help them get to the national finals. A lot of folks come here from all over town. Brings a lot of dollars into Gladewater. According to rodeo director Harold Wells, the money doesn't just go into the city, but also back to participants through scholarships. This year we have eight scholarship recipients for $1,000 each. That's the reason they started the rodeo back in 1938, is to provide extra money. It won't get you through college, but sure a good boost and I'm here with Ride Hard Entertainment, and they come straight from Oklahoma, and this is their third year they've been at the Gladewater Rodeo because they say the rodeo treats them so well, and so do all the other East Texans, and they just continue to have a lot of fun. So if you're wanting to come out here, they're gonna be here all weekend long. Yeehaw! <laughs> It's a great uh, opportunity, you know, especially when they keep asking you back. So obviously we did a good job with everybody. They liked us, you know, and uh, like I say, we're here for the long haul. With multiple events happening this weekend, I asked the city's chamber director if they're worried about a low turnout. Our rodeo is one of the most respected activities. And we don't think of it as competition because Friday and Saturday, we will be sold out. In Gladewater, Jose Alonso. CBS 19. Oh man, and you can clearly see why they would be sold out. Jose, you just showed us some visuals on that and we were like on the edge of our seats here. Well, and being also <laughs> local, I've never actually been, so I may need to check it out, especially after his story. And you heard her, tickets are almost sold out, so you mm -hmm. better get them quick. Exactly.